The Lockheed C-130 Hercules is an American four-engine turboprop military transport aircraft designed and built by Lockheed Martin. The C-130 Hercules primarily performs the tactical portion of the airlift mission. It featured a large, unobstructed, fully pressurized cargo hold that can rapidly be reconfigured for the carriage of troops, stretchers, passengers or airdrops of troops and or equipment into hostile areas. It is now the main tactical airlifter for many military forces worldwide. More than 40 variants of the Hercules, including civilian versions marketed as the Lockheed L-100, operate in more than 60 nations. The C-130 is the longest continuously produced military aircraft at more than 60 years. It's one of the most successful and safest aircraft in history. History and Background As the U.S. entered into the Korean War, the U.S. Air Force realized it did not have a true military transport capable of airlifting combat troops over medium distances and delivering them to short, austere airfields. To fill this need, the U.S. Air Force Tactical Air Command issued a specification in early 1951 for a new medium cargo transport. The then Lockheed Aircraft Corporation won the competition and was contracted to produce two prototype YC-130 aircraft on July 2, 1951. The success of the prototypes led to a production contract. The first production C-130A, which was nearly identical to the prototypes, was flown for the first time on April 7, 1955. A total of 219 were ordered and deliveries began in December 1956. The C-130A featured four powerful Allison T-56 ALA turboprop engines, each delivering 3,750 horsepower and driving a three-bladed Curtis Wright electric reversible propeller. It is the world's premier tactical airlifter. Designed and developed with mission versatility in mind, the C-130 has a unique mix of agility and performance to complete any mission, anytime, anywhere. The latest C-130 to be produced, the C-130J, entered the inventory in February 1999. With the noticeable difference of a six-bladed composite propeller, the C-130J brings substantial performance improvements over all previous models. To date, the Air Force has taken delivery of 121 C-130J aircraft from Lockheed Martin Aeronautics Company. The Hercules fleet has been in continuous production for over six decades, longer than any other military aircraft in the world, and no end of production is yet in sight. Design features and capabilities. The latest C-130J has a length of 34.4 meters, height of 10.1 meters, and wingspan of 40.4 meters. The aircraft can fly up to 2,729 miles and has a maximum speed of 417 miles per hour. It is equipped with four Allison Air Etai 100D3 turboprop engines, each rated at 4,591 shaft horsepower. Its all-composite six-blade R391 propeller system was developed by Dowdy Aerospace. The aircraft can carry a maximum internal fuel load of 4,500 pounds. An additional 18,700 pounds of fuel can be carried in external underwing fuel tanks. The Hercules has proven to be a highly versatile, with the ability to airdrop stores and paratroopers. The Hercules has also been used in so many different roles throughout the world. It can operate on unsurfaced and short runways, and can also use airstrips that are not suitable for most heavy aircraft. It holds the world record for the heaviest and largest aircraft to ever land on an aircraft carrier. Through the use of its air-to-air -air refueling capability, its potential range has been greatly increased. The flexible design of the Hercules enables it to be configured for many different missions, allowing one aircraft to perform the role of many. Much of the special mission equipment added to the Hercules is removable, allowing the aircraft to return to its cargo delivery role if desired. Additionally, the C-130 can be rapidly reconfigured for the various types of cargo, such as palletized equipment, floor-loaded material, airdrop platforms, container delivery system bundles, vehicles, and personnel or aeromedical evacuation. Capacity of the C-130 Hercules 
the C-130 cargo compartment is approximately 41 feet long, 9 feet high, and 10 feet wide, and loading is from the rear of the fuselage. As a tactical transport, the Hercules can carry 92 ground troops or 64 paratroopers and equipment. It can also be configured as a medical evacuation platform, capable of carrying 74 patients on stretchers and their attendants. It also can carry up to 62 fully equipped parachutists who jump simultaneously from double doors on either side of the fuselage. The aircraft has a maximum payload capacity up to 40 tons, depending on the model and configuration. It can carry a lot of vehicles, such as Humvees, trucks, Jeeps, or helicopters. But the C-130 cannot carry an Abrams tank, which is one of the heaviest and most advanced main battle tanks in the world. Weapons and Armament Most C-130s are not equipped for the use of weapons, but some variants, for example AC-130 gunships, can carry and fire small missiles, mainly the Hellfire and Griffin. And some Hercules has been used to drop large fuel air bombs to help clear trees to allow helicopters to land. There is a proposed maritime variant of the C-130 that can carry anti-submarine and anti-ship missiles, this included a specific weapons bay, externally. It can be quickly prepared for firefighting missions using water and chemicals. But for now, most of the 130 does not have any weapons. First flown in 1954, the C-130 has soared through the skies longer than any other military aircraft in history. In an era of stealth fighters, AI-piloted drones, and hypersonic missiles, the C-130 and its long radio antenna is a rugged throwback. But, no matter the mission, no matter the location, Hercules has gone there, is going there, and will go back thanks to its constant state of innovation. To date, more than 60 countries operate or will operate the C-130, which has been used to set 54 world aviation records. Because it is so useful in so many different ways, and it has been around for so freaking long, Without a doubt, the C-130 Hercules is one of the most successful military aircraft ever 